All right, let's get back into another run. Back to the YouTube save file. Looks like uh, last time we beat Satan with uh, Judy or Kane. So today we're actually going to play my other favorite character, which it's actually probably my only favorite character, and only because it's super hard. Uh, Judas is a character that starts with one heart in the Book of Belial, which is just a damage up temporarily for the room. Um, I absolutely love this character. I love glass cannons. Uh, the loss is... Oh my god. The loss is one of my favorite characters, uh, just because of how much of a challenge it poses. I'm actually going to pop the Book of Belial. I don't want to be here forever. All right, come on, Bobo. There you go. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I absolutely love glass cannons. Uh, these can base uh, Judas can only take one hit from champions um, and two hits from other ones, at least in the beginning. So he's not really a glass cannon uh, in the same respect as the losses, because he could take okay, because uh, he could take more than one hit, and I would have rather had the other one here. Um, Rainbow Baby's just familiar, by the way, it shoots random shots. I don't really like this familiar just because it can shoot stuff that'll blow you up. But it really just depends, and it's just a small chance, so I'll take it usually. Um, but yeah, I mean, he, he still can be extremely punishing too, especially with, with how little health you have in the beginning. Um, until you get a health upgrade, which is very common in the beginning, you can't um, actually use curse rooms or get go into curse rooms. Um, and everybody knows as well that's also another really. Uh, speaking of which, all right, one more time. I was not expecting that. I have no idea why. Uh, like I said before, we're going to keep the deaths in here. Bye-bye six win streak. Not that it's very impressive, at least to me. Um, it's something that I do quite often, especially in the beginning of uh, the game itself. Uh, but yeah, if you see there, one shot from uh, champion uh, enemies. Every other enemy is two. And, that, and unfortunately, we got hit by the eight-shot burst of that, other ch of that champion and ended the run. But I will keep losses in this stuff. It just kind of derailed the conversation. <laughs> I'm not too worried about it, to be honest. I want some upgrades. Uh, he has a normal tier rate, slightly ba more higher base damage in the beginning as well as the Book of Belial. So it's overall a really good character if you know how to not take damage. I actually did a run the other day which uh, completed one of the endings uh, for the Kickstarter campaign for the Four Souls uh, expansion pack, uh, which I'm super excited for, um, which involved uh, four player co-op kind of thing. I used Judas as my character. Um, I'm actually going to turn this up. Hold on. There we go. Yeah, I used to play it as Judas. Everybody else played it as something else. Um, and I got so, I recruited some people from Twitter. And it actually gave me a really good idea. I think one of the things I want to do with this YouTube channel is create a series where I uh, go and give people tips in, in co-op play. Because I discovered that you can really uh, remain anonymous in co-op. Because you can just send people a link to join to play the game. So I think that would be a really cool idea. Because I've had a bunch of people go into my streams. And granted, they were just looking for smaller streamers. Uh, because they're more likely to be like, yeah, I'll play with you. Um, come into my stream and ask me if I would play the game with them because they're having a rough time. And I always said no, not because I didn't want to, but just because I didn't think it was ideal. But I th would think it would be something very cool to do uh, with Surrender. And this is amazing. Familiar's back to back, by the way. I don't know why. But it works. Um, I think it would be something cool to do with people because I had a really good time playing with co-op. Um, with four random people that I hadn't played with before. And now I have new friends. At least I hope so. Pop Book of Belial to get our extra damage up. And Baby Plum's going to go bye-bye. I got a YouTube comment today saying I killed him. And they were sad about it. Uh, she deserves it. If it's a girl. Honestly, don't know what it is. But she deserves it. It's an evil character. And we get our health up. No curse room. So we're just going to leave. And just like that, the whole gimmick of Judas is gone. Well, besides the double damage, but we're kind of in really safe territory at this point. Besides the fact that we don't have any soul hearts. Uh, the Book of Belial also gives you a slight increased chance to get a devil deal. And I, oh, okay, well, never mind. But if you can see there, normally when you get hit, it goes down to 36%. Uh, whereas with us having the Book of Belial, it goes down to 48.5. We're playing kind of sloppy today. It's been a few days since I played Isaac. Uh, my Twitch VODs are actually messed up right now. I don't want it. I'm going to take it anyways. My Twitch VODs are actually messed up right now, and I was afraid of streaming or even really playing the game. So I played other stuff in the meantime off stream, um, just because I don't want my VOD from the Four Souls thing to disappear. Because I wanted to make a YouTube video out of it, but it's been three days and it still hasn't processed completely. So when I stream today, after I'm recording this, which you guys won't see this until the day after, um, I'll be able to really check. 
Uh, if it's scuffed forever or just scuffed temporarily. But for now, I don't know. It's a super exciting run for anybody who knows the ending of this game and they're just tagging along for the ride. Um, there's three of them. They're the fast ones, too. These are the Gurglings. They're uh, the yellow variant, so they're fast as hell. But with Book of Belial and Guardian uh, Seraphim, we'll make quick work of them and get Constellation Prize, which should increase our speed, I guess. We're leaving. <laughs> I'm not going to the rest of the floor. Let's try to get as many marks as possible today, too. Actually, I was, I was, ah, dang it. Probably should have went to the shop, but whatever. Metal plate's good for saving our devil deal if I got it one room earlier, but other than that, it doesn't do a whole lot. I mean, we still have Seraphim, which is a, a, like a familiar that grants you a very, very solid damage up. The secret should be here. I was wrong. Um, <laughs> a very, very solid damage up just because uh, his tears are actually Sacred Heart tears. Which we haven't actually seen Sacred Heart, but it's a really, really good item. Uh, no. Waste of a key. And those one, take out the, the non-champion first. And then the explodey champion here, go down after. Kind of surprised the secret room actually isn't there. We saw there I only used two shots from Sarah from itself to kill. Uh, we should not be stepping on these mushrooms. The Globins do one heart of damage, it sucks, but we already lost our 100% devil deal guarantee and we're losing all of our health. Uh, Leo is a very hit or miss item. In rooms like these, they'll be super dangerous because if you can see I'm blowing up the mushrooms and one of them actually did a bad gas thing on me and took away some of my health. For absolutely no reason. That's right, we're still in a safe point. We get 8 damage, 8.71 I believe damage. With uh, the Book of Belial engaged in the fight. So hopefully we actually get a devil deal. I don't know if I'll take it, but we'll see. Two Gertie's back to back. You're gonna want to keep him, or her, I think it's a her, going horizontal. Uh, it's a lot easier to control and they're not as fast for some reason. Another health up. Let's go see what we can get in here. Guppy's head and the eye of the occult. All right, let's go back to glass cannon. We'll keep it the way it's supposed to be. Not taking Guppy's head, it kills us. Let's go. I think we got the item room, right? Yeah, I got metal plate. Let's keep going fast. Five minutes on here. Can't go in there. Ruin my chance. Eye of the occult's a repentance item. It's actually one of my favorites, unless you have brimstone or mom's knife. Uh, Kind of garbage there, but um, when normal tears is perfect. Gives you a damage up, which we kind of needed. Um, and then it allows you to control your tears wherever you shoot. If you can see there, they'll shift with you. An acid, baby. Looks like we're having a familiar run. Actually, not too happy about that. Let's see if we get something good in here. We don't. All right, let's see. I'm going to blow you up, actually. Don't name my coins. My coins, sorry. Uh uh. Mini boss is not what I wanted to see. I'm gonna pop this just to make it quicker. Nice. Hero font. Ancient recall unlocked as well. Hero font gives us two soul hearts, so we're good to go now. No longer a glass cannon, but that's what makes it perfect, I guess. Nice. More soul heart. Secret room might be here. It's not. Could we actually be here, though? I'm just gonna try here. If not, I'll give up on the secret room here. It is. Cool, cool. Just fire and two bombs, which we just wasted, so yeah. We basically got lost nothing in this room. That room always gives me anxiety.
Went through most of this floor. I could go into the curse room, but to be honest, I want to save my soul hearts here. Super secret room might be here. It's not. Three Gerties in a row. Wow. I mean, I'm down. Put her behind her. Get rid of that fool. Another one again. You know, pooters. Love a tears up. I think, I think my first time, a few times I hooked up Eye of the Occult just because it was Eye of the Occult, you know, referencing the eyes and you shoot with tears here. I always thought it gave you a tears up, but it don't. Um, speed. This run's a little rough, but it's okay. And we keep going. Tim's still alive. There goes. Now he's gone. Damage is getting a little worse, and we haven't gotten upgraded quite a while. I'm not in danger of losing my devil deal here, but I'm still. I still don't want to get hit. Drop a pill to see what it is. Infested. Not very good, but it works. Mini boss in a norm room. You gotta love it. This room is not fun either. Hold on. Oh, they're all dead. Except for that one. Go. We went the right way, surprisingly. Um, I have a big, big issue of finding every other room than the item rooms. Like, I'll literally go to the boss room without seeing an item room or a shop. But it's okay. That wasn't, that wasn't too bad. Should have expected him, to be honest. There goes that mini pin hiding. This will give us five bombs. Works. Secret room here? No? No. Secret room here. No. I have no idea where it is. And to be honest, I'm not really looking. It has been quite a few days since I played Isaac. It's not a card that we've seen before. Could donate the other two cents that I have, but we'll save it for now. Even though it's unlikely, I'm gonna go down to this room to the right. Nah. Or I guess it is the right way still. See if there's anything of value down here. And it looks like it actually is the right way. Crawl space? Nope. Crawl spaces span, uh, spawn randomly under rocks. Um, sometimes they'll have an item in it for free. Sometimes they'll have nothing. Sometimes they'll have a chest or two. Um, sometimes they have what's called a black market. Although I do believe it is glitched right now, so don't go looking for them. Uh, don't go into them. You go straight to the I am air room. We're gonna try here for the secret room. It is. So we're gonna place this here. Blow both of you up, because F you. Get a coin out of it. So a coin for a bomb's horrible deal, but it's good. It's good. You can actually even move your tears down. It doesn't have to just be uh, horizontal directions. Alright, another pill. Got acid, baby, so why not? I'm so happy I didn't use that in the boss. War. Ah, we're not doing too hot in items here. Don't step on the bomb thing. Should blow him up soon. There he goes. He's very fast, but so are we. So he can't really catch up and do anything to us. That's alright, we got another devil deal to see what's in it. Goat head, which I don't know if that's necessarily worth it here. We got a few more floors to go, but I don't know if we'll get any more health upgrades because we haven't gotten any yet. So, we'll do it anyways. Uh, two and a half hearts, soul hearts, non replenishable. See how good we do. I'm gonna stay down here. This is actually rather scary. I've never, I haven't seen this room very much. Stay in the corner. We're gonna go up. Okay, we're safe. That's an actual tough room there. Nothing. Oh, I hate that enemy. 
Bopping it. Ooh, that was bad. Another, we're actually gonna get conjoined here, which is good with Eye of the Occult, but we did lose damage. It's okay, we're shooting three tiers at a time now. Lost a little bit of tears, so I don't know if we really come out on top here. I don't really like this baby, which is another Repentance baby. Um, I mean, it worked there, I guess. This little dude here. Get him. Got the item room. Got the shop. Unfortunately, it's mom. Let's go. Center rock over here. Two bombs, thank you. Surprised I did not get hit there. I think it's because they changed it to contact damage from explosion, like I've said before. Oh. Soul heart here. Devil deal as well, which is probably useless. We're super early for the yeah. I mean, we get black hearts. Little brimstone is not going to benefit us because I are the occult. So, uh, one damage up. I could probably pick up an item and thing. It's a HP as well. We already lost here, so. She didn't drop too many red poops and not in an ideal spot either. Actually, if you get carry on clean here, uh, she drops a red poop right where they spawn. They literally insta die. I'm not going to take this just in case it could be a telepills and I don't want to get out of here. Oh, I should pop that. I forgot you can pop it multiple times now. Not that I necessarily missed the pop on it, but. Ah! Yeah, I don't, I don't like Leo. It's nice to be able to say that you can walk over rocks, but look at how many bombs we have. We don't really need to. It's all good. Young Larry would have had on it. That is a mod. As you see, as uh, the dark one crashes into the red poop here and gets hurt. He's dead now. I'll book a ball out, get a small damage up again. This shouldn't be too long. Frails. Horrible, actually. He breaks a little earlier than I wanted him to. Thank you. Fish and Steven, my two least favorite bosses in the game, just because they give you, they have a really high chance of giving you a useless item. I think Gish is actually a guaranteed chance of giving you a rather loose, useless item. Steven can drop Steven, but little Steven, eh. besides the homing tears, I don't like it too much. But in boss rush, they give you nothing. So, it's all good. Pop again. Thank you, Acid Baby. Oh, our damage is going super high now. That was a really fast round, actually. I got hit by that. All right, you're out of control, dude. No, stop it. Here comes his homie, who's dead, too. Pop it again, get another damage up. I believe it, the amount of damage that you get by popping the Book of Lyle goes down each time you use it. But still, I'll take a damage up. And the, the speed in which we're destroying these bosses is quite amazing, honestly. This guy should be dead here. I'm dead there. Oh, we're at 15 damage now. So many Gurdies just run. Oh, dude, the red. Ah, Gurgling's uh, trail. I don't like the amount of health we're going into and uh, the womb with.
Acid Baby giving us a lot of pills. I really hope they're not bad. Made quick work of those guys. And this guy. Thank you. This guy's dead here. One, two, three. Not even scared of you. More Gerties. Which is fine, I guess. Doesn't matter too much. Get rid of him quick. Get rid of him quick. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I really... That was amazing. You're a team player here, bud. Young Death, all of you slowing me down. Just kind of scuffed things a little bit, but I think we're done. Woo! It's horrible. I don't even want it. But we are going to pop these pills and see what they are. One. Bad. No. Good luck. Should be another pill in here, right? I guess not. We're, we're going to touch pause. Just stops the enemies until you shoot a tear. It's all good. We can go back into here and not get that, so we're leaving. That was easy, kinda, not really. Maybe. <laughs> Dude, I love that little animation there. First time I ever saw that made me laugh like a mother. You're crazy. <laughs> that was horrible. What's in here? No. Fine. This. I was in a bit of a pinch there. Got me. These boss trap rooms in the womb and later can be very, very brutal. Speed up's good. Luckily, we only got hit once. Do it again. It would be good if I could get health. The amount of range you also get from my other call is insane. Especially if you have other range upgrades. I don't believe it's an incremental one. I think it's a, it's a straight one. We never took a tears down from... Uh... Remember, you don't get items in the womb. So we're in a good spot. Check to the boss. Get it done as soon as possible. This is actually super annoying. Oh god. Dude, why aren't you popping up? Hello? S senior? Thank you. Okay, let's go. Lock two. Luckily, the bricks that we're stepping on are not uh, ones that have a chance to explode like the one in the, right here. Uh, HP and a damage up, which is good. So, very slight damage up, but it's fine. Ob's Curse, more bombs, a little bit of utility to them. It's not the best, but we get another one next floor. We got two hearts, so hopefully it's not a guppy item because I passed up on two. Yeah, that's not even worth going into, to be honest. This is horrible. Eye lasers are bad. I didn't see the bomb. I really should look before I walk into something. Thank you. Flat files, super good. Powerful. Flat file is a repentance item that just uh, reduce, uh, gets rid of spikes in the entire run and as long as you're holding it. This guy is kind of... Actually, you know what? No, because I could step on the bomb. Not even worth trying. Our bomb is super good now. Our, <laughs> our bomb, our damage! Hard damage! 
I think we'll be fine. We just need health. Desperately. Could be a tinted rock in here. Not in there. Nope. I think we're going the we're going the right way. See? No spikes in here. Still no health either. I mean, you're not gonna pay out with anything, but let's see. Oh! I was wrong! Alright, get rid of the ice first, always. I mean, you can't have no choice, so just laser you, dude. This is a horrible spot to stand in. Magdalene! Careful. Another. Let's go ahead. Epic Axe and Shadow Baby. All right, Epic Axe are really good uh, item. Again, I don't, I don't think. Oh, I don't think we only got the Satan fight because of the other thing. I think it just unlocks by default, but I may be wrong. It's been quite a while since I actually played through the whole game like this, so. Ah! Come on. Thank you! What does this do? I don't even remember what Watch Better does. Oh, clearing a room. I'm popping this, dude. Two monsters is bad. Two monster twos. There goes one. Second jump. Sometimes he does the laser afterwards, other times he just goes back to jumping. I've seen him jump back to back to back to back quite a bit. So you never know. Just be careful. Despite Monster being an easy boss, Monster 2 is not. More speed is good. Max speed I really like is 1.8. These guys have super long range. Ah! Okay, I think we're good. So, uh, boss room's gonna be over here. Unless it goes up on that way, but we'll see. No matter what this dice room is, I'm not gonna do it, but I'm gonna go in there anyways. Definitely not doing it. We're good here. As long as I can not get hit in the devil fight, we'll be, or the Satan fight, we'll be fine. I went the wrong way. Secret room here? Maybe? No. It's either up here, like, take his right here and up. Nope. Okay, we went the complete wrong way. I can't even really go into that room there. Let's go down here and see. Could be. There goes the crawl space. Sorry, this, this startled me. We don't have a whole lot of health, and I need every single hit for the Satan fight. Well, at least I think I do. It's better safe than sorry, right? I could technically go into the curse room now, but again, it's not really worth it. Bombing arms is good. We'll be able to use the bomb in the Satan fight because it homes onto him. As you see the description there, it's just homing bombs. I think we're going the right way. There it goes. We're good. Maggie, please stop. Sorry, my cat keeps jumping on the chair. It's cute, but she does it when she wants attention. Um, which I'll give her in a minute after I'm done recording this video. We need to go back and get that heart. Nope. 
No. I think we're, I hope we're going the right way. Let's see. Yeah, we are. The two mini bosses, well, half mini bosses, I guess. Okay. Kind of scared, but. That one should be dead. Oh. I'm gonna pop it. Oh, he died. Well, looks like we didn't really need um, all three hearts. I guess I could have done it on one. No, not really. I got hit once. <sighs> that was scary. Either way, thanks for watching. I really appreciate you guys standing by and supporting me. Uh, a few of you guys have been around for quite a bit, and I see people watching my videos. And even though it's not a lot, I do greatly appreciate you guys. Uh, sorry for the inconsistent upload schedule. I promise to get better from here on out. Um, when is a little bit indefined. I'm going to try to record at least 12 videos this week. Uh, just to kind of get it going, I want to get this ball rolling because I do think there is uh, a chance that this kind of series is going to be beneficial. Uh, not only to me, but to people who want to enjoy the content. Other than that, uh, thanks for watching and I'll catch you all later. Ooh, Judas's tongue. It turns all devil deals into one hearts, I think. We'll, we'll talk about it again when we get it.